Portander. The cradle of human civilization. We know war. It has been at our side for millennia, coming and going with the indifference of the tides. Our most recent sprouted from rebellion. For reasons unknown, a mage by the name of Isamo Tahar gathered the noble houses behind him in an attempt to overthrow the crown. burnt towns to ashes. Abominations ravaged the battlefields. Men and women were torn apart with the snap of a finger. Only a sacrifice by our queen achieved what none had thought possible. An end to the slaughter. Once more believe that their suffering has come to an end. They hope. They dream. But the tides don't change. Strikers Battle League. Prepare for Strike, a five-on-five -five sport like soccer that's way heavy on offense. Aim for goals by dribbling and passing to teammates, as well as by using tackles, items, and crushing special shots. 
The main rule in this sport is to rule the field. Try to score more goals than your opponents. There are two things to keep in mind that'll help you with your strategies. First, the gear you equip. It changes not only your appearance, but also your stats like speed, strength, and pass accuracy. Customize as you see fit. Second, the Hyper Strike. To activate this shot, grab an orb when it appears on the field and charge it while your opponents are distracted. Hit the net and you'll score not one, but two goals. Up to eight players, four players on each team can compete against each other on one Nintendo Switch system. In addition to individual matches, online play will have an online club mode. Join an in-game club and compete for placement in the rankings. Up to 20 players can join a club. So create your own and invite friends and family to play alongside you or join an existing one owned by other players. Try to become the world's top club. With items, tackles, and hyper strikes, anything goes on this field. Mario Strikers. It's quarry forever! I just want to get you guys safely out of Dodge before the sun goes down. Damn it! I thought I told you kids to check everything. Look, it's not that big of a deal, okay? We'll just spend one more night here. No! No! Just stop. Let me think. Okay. Make sure that everybody is inside the lodge for tonight. Lock the doors. No one in, no one out. No one. Got it? I'll be back first thing in the morning, and we'll get you all on the road. What if we're out partying tonight, out in the woods, and we end up in a most dangerous game situation? Like when people hunt other people? Yeah, what, I mean, think about it. It's Camp is over, and hunting season has just begun. I did see a weird light in the treehouse across the lake. That was pretty spooky. Maybe it's your girlfriend, Brian. The hack of hack, it's Corey. <sighs> Should we hear that? Mm-hmm. Should we look? Mm hmm ah! Maybe it was the bears. And why does everyone blame everything on bears? Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like, zombies, aliens, time-hopping Draculas? Uh, Brian? Hey! Run! <laughs> Please. We ain't playing games no more, little girl. There's something, there's something coming! One. Ah! Silent. Two. Lost. Max. We're lost. Three. Terrified kids are bad for business. You have to cut it off! Cut it off! Cut it off! Anyway, maybe just ease up on the ghost stories? Sorry. Just stick to Kumbaya next time, okay? What's that? You guys don't do Kumbaya anymore? <laughs>